this is Student Improv Nottingham and welcome to the Easter special. Woo! I'm Becky and I'm here with six people in the studio and of course Sam Sam the radio man here for our Easter special. Can you introduce your names and your buzzers for the later rounds? I'm Emily. Bunny, 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 bunny. I'm Dan. What's up, Doc? I'm Mike. Egg. I'm Gabby. Bop. I'm Tom. Choo -choo. I'm Tim. Chocolate. And we're going to jump straight into our first game called Change. Emily and Dan, you'll start, also known as my bunny team. <laughs> Yay! You're going bunny, to act... bunny, bunny, bunny. <laughs> exactly. You're going to act out a scene and anything I don't like, I'll ask you to change till we have a, a glorious scene which will be known throughout the ages. So, as your bunnies, your suggestion is you're moving into a new warren. <laughs> and go. I say, Tabitha, this warren's tremendously damp, isn't it? Trevor, it's all your fault. If you hadn't built it near a river, then we wouldn't have this problem. Well, how was I supposed to know that the river was going to flood in the springtime and fill this whole place with water up to the roots? Well, now we're going to have to learn how to swim, and bunnies can't normally swim. Change. Now we're going to have to learn how to poker, and bunnies don't normally poker. Change. Now we're going to have to learn how to tap dance, and bunnies can't tap dance. We've got furry feet. But we have giant furry feet, so we can make very loud tap dancing that goes... Very Change. loudly. So we, we're we going to have to softly tap dance so we don't wake up the neighbours with our enormous flumping bunny rabbit feet. Okay, right. Change. Brilliant idea! <laughs> we're going to become tap dancers. Yes. Now what we have to do is find our 46 children. They've got to be around here somewhere. They can't have drowned that quickly. Change. <laughs> oh no, they've drowned. That was quick. <laughs> Oh, that's a bit of a downer to start the show. <laughs> yes, we can't have them as backup dancers in our tap dancing act now. Change! Oh, and I was hoping they'd be tap dancers in our backup act. Change! <laughs> that you, sentence made no sense. You know, we could just put string on the end of their paws and make them dance around a bit. <laughs> it's perfect! And slightly macabre. Fantastic. <laughs> Thanks very much, you two. <laughs> Good Macabre scene. being the appropriate term there. A point for both the bunnies. Yay. Right, we're going to move on to our lambs. Mike and Gabby. Lambs. We're lambs. Yeah. Oh, God. Okay. You two have just robbed a bank. Go. Sally, get in the car. Hurry, hurry, I'm hurry. I'm coming, I'm coming. But can you help me with this bag? Jesus, it's pretty heavy. Okay, okay. I'll, look, you shouldn't have overfilled the bags. I know we're trying to get £500,000. but Change. I know we're trying to get £1 million. Pounds, Change. But I know we're trying to find... My business card somewhere in the vault. <laughs> I placed it there somewhere. Well, Dave, that was an important business card, you know, considering you had it specially made, didn't Change. you? Change. Considering it was made out of gold. Change. Considering it was made out of lamb's wool. Yes. <laughs> and I just still hadn't quite got the copy people ready to make millions of them. It would have been awesome. And yet, no, I Change. misplaced it. I'm sorry. Uh, <laughs> I was... It was going to be terrible, terrible idea, because Lambswell really is too warm. Uh, it would have been dreadful, because... <laughs> I don't know. It's a Lambswell business card. This is completely bizarre. Well, it's different, that's for sure. Yes. <laughs> OK, anyway, get in the car. Uh, OK, yes, OK. <laughs> so get out of here. They get into the car and they speed away. Um, OK. <laughs> it's a warm-up. Change is a warm-up. It's all right. It's meant to go badly. Okay, I'm going to move on to Tom and Tim, who are, of course, my chicks. Sorry, pardon? Chick magnets? You're the chicks. Uh -huh. No, she didn't. And uh, we'll have a suggestion from Sam. Oh, God. Oh, oh, well. <laughs> Making good radio. Come on, Sam. Oh, you're, come on. You're meant you to be a pro. Want... This is, this is your show. I've thought of two already. You think Go of on, one. then. No, no you... No, you, you. Hey. Children, <laughs> we stop having this argument. Irre irresponsible. How about just... Irresponsibility. 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 Oh, Billy. Why have we given them yes, this? Yes, Samuel. <laughs> I think you'll find we're starting. <laughs> Billy? Yes, Daddy? Play with this spike. Oh, thanks. <laughs> oh, thanks, Daddy. I've always wanted a spike. Yeah, yeah. Play, play bungee jumps with it. Change. Yep. Yeah. Ah, why don't you play hopscotch with it? Change. Why don't you play pick up sticks, except instead of sticks, it's spike. Instead of pick up, you ram it through your eyes. Change. Oh, this is a this is an awful idea. I've, I've been a terrible father to you, Billy. I've, it was ever since your mother died. I, I've just been so lost, so forlorn. Billy, forgive me. 
It's okay, Daddy. Change. It's not okay, Daddy. You're a very bad, bad person. You should really not have killed Mum. That was, that was just terrible. Look, look, look. She ate my lasagna. Change. Look, she was sleeping with my dog. <laughs> Change. Look, I am just deeply mentally disturbed and it occurred to me as a good idea at the time. I found acceptance in this Billy and you must too if we're ever to grow as a family. I just don't know I can do it, Daddy. Change. I just want to do it, Daddy, but I, I, I just don't trust you. I, I hate you. I Change. Really do. I love you. Give me a hug. Get away oh. from me and get back on that spike. <laughs> well... That's as best as we're going to do for our warm-up <laughs> game. We're going to move on to a game called Intros, and I've, I got very excited about the lovely weather, so it's all summery and sunshiny. <laughs> right, we're going to start with the chicks. Okay. Tim and Tom. Uh, are, we doing, are we doing the first one or the second one? Are the bunnies and lambs first ready one. to guess? Yes. 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 All right. And Sam is also... Yeah, yeah but... Okay. You're very, what's, for it? what's with you today, Sam? You only get to guess if they don't get it. Are we ready, on. children? Yeah. Okay. Go on, do the song. All right, ready? It's Feel Good by the Gorillas. Well, <laughs> well done, Emily. Well done. I made an effort with a laugh. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Gabby and Mike, let's have your first song. <laughs> Sorry. Is that all we get? That's Feel Good Ink by the Gorillas. Shall we have it again? One more time. Thanks for that input, Gabby. Last Christmas. Dancing in the moonlight. Yes. Well done. Nicely done. Another point to Emily. We're getting beaten, it's not good. Ah. All right, Emily and Dan, I can't wait for your first performance. <laughs> Especially the look on Dan's face makes me think he is prepared and ready to go. I know music so well. Right, let's, let's have it. it. Right. You s- <laughs> okay, this is rocking it, okay? Yes, go. And that's all you get. Um. That was fairly shocking. A remix of Gandalf's drums in the deep. Do you want to try again? What's what you're miming to me, Emily? But I can't. Which one are you doing? Can I ask? Really? <laughs> oh, I mean, yes, I heard it. Would Try you like to, get to do it. your version? <laughs> I may have slightly forgotten how it's gone because ding, I only ding, heard ding, it once. Ding, 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 ding
The I, beat oh. Praying Mantis. Oh, yeah. Oh, 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 I can't believe you didn't get that. Becky, um, I think you lose a point for that. That's a point for me. Oh. Let's hear I what some actual sure music sounds like, shall we? And we're back for part two of the Easter special with Student Improv Nottingham. Woo! So, as we were through the break, each team gave a word or two to the other teams, trying to be as nice as they possibly could, or as mean as they possibly could, to create the Easter film. Everyone goes to see a film in the Easter break, so I've got three adverts here, and I'm going to decide which one I'd like to go see. So the words that were suggested for Emily and Dan were blue and horseshoe. Let's see what film you got up with. It's the feel-good film of the summer. In Blue Horseshoe, Hugh Grant is a horse. <laughs> Hi there. Hi. <laughs> nice to see you again. <laughs> Ray! A middle-aged horse living alone in the stables and hoping that he can find romance. Then all of a sudden, Carrie, the young, energetic filly, comes galloping in and shakes his life up. No, no, no! In the feel-good romantic comedy this Easter, Hugh Grant is Blue Horseshoe. Is it in the <laughs> summer or Easter? The feel-good romance of the Easter. <laughs> Easter season. Well, the Easter season. I quite enjoyed that. Uh, maybe I'll go see that. I'm just going to... No offence, but I'm going to look around to see what else is on. Okay. Mike and Gabby. <clears throat> This April, get ready for the greatest adventure of the year with Jerry the Caterpillar. Hello, chaps. I've got such big dreams. Jerry the Caterpillar and his friends are off to find the greatest, greatest cheese of their time. Oh, I hope to find it one day. And when they find this cheese, they'll do great things with it. We can rule the world. We'll never have to worry about money again. This April, Jerry the Caterpillar. Ooh. So it's like a psychological thriller. <laughs> you could say that. Oh, I like that idea. Maybe, maybe, maybe. Okay, let's hear the chicks. Coming this fall, a film The Guardian is calling deeply offensive. <laughs> He was on top of his game, an angel in the court of God, but then he discovered he was both sinister and omnipotent. <laughs> I am so much better than you. You shall suffer. God didn't like that, and so sent him down to hell. But now he's come up in Manhattan to live amongst us all. What of this great city of buildings and people around me? But how will we deal with the hurly-burly of modern-day life? How does this microwave work? Push the buttons! No, no, don't! Defrost! <laughs> but it's not that simple. He meets a girl. Oh, Lucifer, I, I, I didn't like you at first because you're nine foot tall and red and evil, but I can really see the goodness in your heart now. Will he find a heart or will it all go to hell? <laughs> the Metro is calling this. What? Did they make this? Seriously? No, I don't believe you. The Independent said, Oh God. Oh, oh God. <laughs> Jason Segal starring in this summer blockbuster. It's Lucifer living at large in Manhattan. <laughs> I think I'll go see that film. <laughs> Definitely. So although you did manage to get blue and horseshoes, so those are points for you guys. Did you get in cheese? Yeah! yeah. 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 Jerry, Jerry the Caterpillar's on his adventure to the greatest cheese. Come on, Becky, keep up. Was it the Caterpillar! Was it very I've written down catapult. No, no, it was Caterpillar well, and cheese, wrong. Becky. Oh. Come on now. I'm sorry, that's a minus point for me. Get a new host. <laughs> <laughs> You'll need a sinister or omnipotent. <laughs> omnipotent. Well, you got both those words in there, so that's both. Language was good. <laughs> Well, I'm going to swap round the teams. <gasps> just, to just to demonstrate my power. I'm still top dog. Right, Sam? Yes! <laughs> Sam is nodding. I thought so. Right, swap round teams. No! Now, is, is an order every, to, yes, I everybody move. move. Daniel. Well, oh. back. Hello, Mike. All right. <laughs> now, I've got some new teams. Just to show that I'm, I'm powerful and strong. Right, Sam? Yeah. Right? Oh. Hulk. You're, you're hulking. 
hold me <laughs> <laughs> okay so we've got some new teams